Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. I'm working on an 07 uh, Chevy Avalanche right now. We just got started with this thing. I decided to go ahead and shoot, shoot the video. So this is an 07 Avalanche. Nothing fancy, but they're really good trucks. Uh, interior isn't bad. We're gonna do some, just uh, vacuum everything out and clean the cup holders and stuff which again aren't real bad and then just a general clean i'm not real concerned about the interior i told the owner uh also my buddy dean uh you guys i'm doing his motorcycle as well two different detailing videos though um we'll be doing the one system the complete one system coating with the pro coatings uh we got some issues with the hood um, a little bit of uh, clear coat failure here and there. The plan, and you, if you can see, it is pretty dull. The plan is going to be to use the universal all-in-one to really bring the paint back and make it look good. Uh, he's moving to Wisconsin, and I want to make sure all he has to do when he gets there is maintain. Uh, I've got this transfer to remove up here. So we'll see how that comes out. I'm also gonna fix the headlights for him. Those are kind of gross, but that's it. 07 Avalanche, um, I got my partner in crime over here, Tony. She's gonna be working on the interior while I get working on the bike, but it'll be two different videos, you'll see. All right, gonna go ahead and get started. You've seen the exterior of this thing. I'm hoping that that gas spill will come out with the polishing. But otherwise, she doesn't look too bad. I'm gonna see if I can't hydrate all of this as well. So, time to get to work. All right, back on this avalanche. Just completed this uh, Harley Davidson Rocker C. And uh, I've had Tony over here working on this avalanche. She washed clay barred and uh, Got everything dry. She cleaned the wheels and tires. And so now uh, the next step is to go, go into, I'm gonna put her on the universal all-in-one polish while I straighten out these headlights. Um, I'm gonna do that with, uh, I'm gonna sand them down with 2000 grit, then I'm gonna finish them with infinite cut. And then I'll apply the one system coatings on it because the entire truck is getting the one system coatings as well. So we're going to go ahead and get to work. We'll check back in a few. All right, just kind of a mid detail update. Tony got the interior done and uh, she's working on the ex exterior. She's polishing it with uh, Universal All in One. I'm actually working on the headlights I showed you before. That's what they look like, well, that's what the before picture is. And uh, just because we're, we're working on the befores, I have not done anything with this area here that has that transfer, but I will as I'm over here working on this headlight. But I did get this other headlight straight. Looks a lot better than it did, but it's far from perfect. But we all know perfection is not reality. All we can expect to receive in this effort in deta detailing game is uh, better than it was before. And that's exactly where we're at. So that light looks good. I'm gonna move right along to the next one and that uh, bumper situation, but trucks brightening up, that's for sure. All right, I'm gonna get that other light straight while Tony uh, knocks out more of that polishing and then we'll put on the coatings and be good to go. All right, this 07 Chevy Avalanche is all complete. She's got some shine to her that she did not have prior to polishing and coating. So what ha happened was full one system detail. So washed with Infinite Use Detail Juice 1, diluted. Then clay barred with my ultra fine grade uh, Japanese clay. Uh, after that, we wiped the whole exterior down, including the trim with uh, universal uh, clean and prep. 
diluted two ounces in a 16 ounce bottle. Then we put 14 ounces of water in it. So one part product to seven parts water is how I'm using that these days for pretty much everything. Um, you can use it up to one part product to I believe 12 parts water and it, it works fine. Um, I have found my happy medium between aggressiveness and uh, that kind of thing is one part product to uh, seven parts water. So, um, then we polish everything with a uh, universal all-in-one. It has some clear coat failure, some really heavy oxidation. This Most of this truck has been repainted. Uh, you can see all the waves in the bodywork. Um, I did show you this headlight. It came out really well. That headlight has lots of issues but came out very well also. Um, all that transfer is gone. That looks awesome. Front end looks great. I did go ahead and treat all the trim, but I use the universal dressing to treat the trim. This piece is really, really bad, and they looked bad before I even messed with them. Um, unfortunately, it's just been beat, and they've tried. You can tell a lot of times when it looks like this, they've tried using a heat gun at some point and basically just trashed the plastic. So um, I'm guessing that's the problem there. You can see that the rest of it looks pretty good. All the inside areas look great. This side looks good. Uh, that side is just generally beat up and broken down. Uh, we clean the wheels uh, and tires with universal clean and prep. Uh, I dress the tires with universal dressing. What you're looking at right there is one part product to seven parts water. That is value right there, folks. The one system literally is my best of the best, but also uh, so I should say in uh, performance and durability, but it also is the best of the best in uh, concentrate. They are the most concentrated products that I have. So this is the top of the line stuff, and it looks amazing. So that's an 07 Chevy Avalanche. And you can see it's been repainted because of that. You can also see that there was a huge spot where all the ripples are, uh, where it's been, this whole side was repainted. But it's got 180,000 miles plus on it, and he said. Um, the interior looks good. We wiped the door jams out. Uh, we did a very basic interior detail. Uh, we did clean the headliner quite a bit. Uh, the leather is black, the carpet's black, but they didn't need any shampooing. So all we did was vacuum it out real well. We cleaned the cup holders and the console area and then wiped everything down with uh, Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 on the interior, straight up. Uh, and then, like I said, we did the door jams and that kind of thing. The exterior after the polish got Univ Universal Coating Pro followed by Ultra Endurance Max Coat Pro. And as most of you guys know, you you lay down the Universal Coating Pro or Universal Coating, whatever version. The versions on the side are the consumer versions. Those two together should give you up to two years worth of uh, longevity. Uh, when you uh, have a professional install the pro versions because consumers, the general consumer cannot have, doesn't have access to the pro versions. When you have the pro versions installed, uh, that is a five-year situation. You can also see how wavy that is right there. This thing's definitely been painted several different times. Uh, so anyway, Universal Coating Pro and Ultra Endurance Max Coat Pro. Uh, that's a two-part coating system. My ceramic acrylics uh, coating system where one part gets applied and then the second part is actually has more of the hardener in it that makes it all work. So uh, those two together are pretty fantastic, super slick, really nice. So, all right guys, thank you so much for listening to me babble. I appreciate 
you guys taking the time to watch these videos. Um, I did do this Harley Davidson Rocker C prior to the truck. It looks amazing. It got the one system as well as the pro coatings. Uh, I also used the three motorcycle products from detailjuice.com on that bike. So anyway, thanks again for uh, watching these videos. I appreciate you guys. If I can help you with your detailing endeavors, please let me know. 813-846-4406 is my cell. Check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. It's a group on Facebook where we talk about only my products, my processes, what I've got going on. If you want to see more of my work, subscribe to this YouTube channel. Um, if you want to learn more about my products, you can reach out directly. My cell phone number is 813-846-4406. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Remember, I'm detailing full time again, so if you guys need something, please reach out and let me know. Thanks again, guys. Have a great day.